my channel so today I'll be doing a get ready with me video and I haven't done one of those in like never so I decided to just do this with you I'm actually going to my, my old halls concert they have one every single year and yes the hall that I'm talking about is the one where I had that horrible experience because of my crazy psycho stalker ex-boyfriend but the thing about it is I loved being on haul for the one reason of being able to perform I always participated in every single Thing that they had whether it was a competition or a whole concert I really loved being there because of that I just said why not film a get ready with me while I was at it so I really hope you guys enjoy this video and I have to say that if you are like me and you don't like colors on your lids because I really don't wear colors on my eyes at all I love that pop of color on your lower lid so that is exactly what I will be doing so as you can see my top of my outfit is mint green so I just decided to add a pop of green at the bottom of my eyes as well as some shades to it and I really loved how it turns out and I just added a bright lips to complement my look it just goes to show that if you don't like colors on your lids you can love a pop of color on your lower lash line so that is what I did I really hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up if you would like to see lots more videos like these and don't forget to subscribe on your way out if you haven't already so you won't miss a thing I'll see you in my next video bye guys so starting with my makeup, I'm going to take the color Foxy from my Naked Basics palette and apply that all over my lids using a flat shader brush from Sigma and then from that same palette, I'm going to take Naked 2 and with a blending brush, and I'm going to apply that right above my crease to just warm that area up for a little more definition to my look since it's very very simple. I'm using Faint to just darken it up like I said and then I'm going to line my lower lash line with this green eyeliner. And once that is done, I'm going to take my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Ammo Palette and this color called Mildew. And with an angled brush from Sigma, I'm just going to apply that over the liner that I just applied on my lower lash line. From my next Urban Decay palette, and this one is the Mariposa palette, I'm going to take this gorgeous color called Money. I'm just going to run that over what I just did and I'm going to take Maui Wawi from my Ammo palette and a pencil brush. Apply that to the inner corners of my eyes and this really adds a gorgeous pop to this entire look. And then I'm going to wing out my eyes, not too traumatic though because I want the focus to be at the bottom of my eyes. And then I'm just going to extend that line from the inner corner just like I always do. I just feel as if that's the look that I'm going for these days. So of course some mascara for our lashes. You can add fake lashes if you would like and then as a brow highlight I'm using Foxy again from my palette. I'm going to take some scotch tape and just press that to my face to remove any fallout from all of those shimmery powders because you don't want to be glittering everywhere. So I'm going to bronze my face like the normal way that I do and the sides of my nose, my jawline as well as the hollows of my cheek. And then I'm going to take Coralina, a beautiful blush from Milani and I'm going to apply that to the apples of my cheeks. And then I'm going to use this Milani illuminating face powder and use that as a highlight above the apples of my cheeks down the bridge of my nose as well as at my cupid's bow. So for my lips, I'm going to have a little bit of fun with Girl About Town and it's a gorgeous pink color but I want to mix this up a little bit with Pink Nouveau which is also from MAC and I just love the bobby pink color that I ended up getting. So this is my finished makeup look so I really hope that you liked it and for my hair I will be using my new me reverse curling wand which I really love. If you want a tutorial using this wand, thumbs up this video or comment down below and let me know. I didn't go into too much detail since this isn't a hair tutorial but this is just basically how my hair looks. So now we can go on to my outfit. So I'm going to take this gorgeous statement necklace because I'm really going to be simple with this look and this just makes my outfit pop. And for my shoe, I'm going to do some 6 inch lace shoes and I really really love this. And I'm only 5'2", so if you expected a tall person when you met me, I'm very sorry, but I am extremely small. So for my bracelet, I have this gorgeous gold one with this cute little bow because I love bows. And I'm just going to pick up this random ring because all of mine are in my apartment, but I love it anyway because my mom gave it to me. So on my nails, I am using my Color Show. It's a Maybelline nail polish, which I love. 
and it's a mint green called green with envy and i'm very much into pastels like dark nail polishes do not look good at me at all so i'm just going to spritz some of my victoria's secret bombshell and to complement my look i'm going to be using this gorgeous lace green clutch which matches my outfit perfectly and speaking about outfits, so I'm wearing this gorgeous lace green bandeau top as well as this peplum skirt. Here is my necklace like I showed you as well as an up close of my top which I really love. So here is my clutch as well as the accessories that I chose. I really love this outfit and this is a funny henna fake tattoo my friend gave me. Yes, that's what friends do. But this is my entire outfit. I really hope you guys enjoy this get ready with me video. I never really did one of these so I hope that you like it. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe on your way out if you haven't already so you won't miss a thing. I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.